What's up, YouTube? It's Matt Book here. Uh, so first I wanted to say uh, Happy Thanksgiving to all of you. So I should have said that yesterday, which I did on Twitter, so be sure to follow me on Twitter. Uh, but I didn't post any video today, so you probably didn't see that. Um, so uh, today, for today's tutorial, I'm just going to make a quick tutorial here, basically on how to use uh, Smack Leopard. So if you don't know what Smack Leopard is, basically uh, you hit, uh, only works with uh, MacBooks. Uh, basically, when you hit the screen uh, of your MacBook, it changes space. So you can see, uh, I'm just hitting the space, uh, the edges of my MacBook, and basically it changes the space just by hitting it uh, just a, a little bit. So uh, that's quite a nice feature. So it's basically all MacBooks with accelerometers in them. So basically, that's uh, the unibody MacBooks and MacBook Pros, the old MacBook, the white MacBook, black MacBook. Uh, so basically, all those MacBooks which are uh, power books. I don't think so. Um, so yeah, and you'll need leopard or snow leopard or higher. Uh, I hope that works later in the future in case you're watching this video. Uh, so basically a few things you need. So you'll need uh, download two, uh, two things. So basically you'll need download uh, smack leopard dot command and AMS tracker. So both of those links will be in the description. Uh, so these will be direct links so you can download them right away. So there will be, um, so everything you download you have to put in one folder and there will be uh, three text documents you can just throw them away. So basically that's like um, uh, some stuff uh, like license, warranty and some other stuff. Uh, so you can just throw them away as long as you have AMS tracker and smack leopard dot command. So once you have those two things, you want to uh, put those two things in one folder and be sure to uh, know the name of the folder and where it's located. So um, you want to open smack leopard command in text edit, and then in text edit uh, you want to scroll down to the bottom of the uh, document and basically here you can uh, it says you can adjust sensitivity here. Uh, so the original file uses thir uh, 30. Um, so basically here you're gonna have 30 when you're gonna download the file. So now, as you can see, I have uh, 30 here. So you, you can adjust the sensitivity. Uh, so the lowest, it's uh, the most sensitive. And if you go to 40, it's less sensitive. So what I like is uh, 10. That's like really sensitive. You probably want to do it with 20. Uh, so yeah, that's about the, the best for uh, like the average. Uh, so go ahead and put 20 or 10, doesn't really matter. Uh, so then, once you have changed that, here there are two other lines. Uh, so um, here basically, oh sorry guys, uh, here basically um, if you have, if you use control arrows to change between spaces, uh, it's set to control, but I use option uh, arrows to change through spaces, so basically here you have to put option, uh, there will be written control, so be sure to put option down, and here option as well, if you use option, if you use control, just leave it as it is. So uh, then be sure to save it, so just go to file and then save. Um, so then you can quit out text edit. And um, so now you want to go to the terminal. So you, you have your two uh, things here, AMS tracker and your command uh, with your favorite stuff or preferences, I mean. So then you want to open up terminal. And here you want to first of all go to the, the folder itself. So basically you need the path of the folder. So basically for me it's on my desktop and then it's called smack. Uh, if you just have it on your desktop I'll show you that too. So you need to put cd space slash and then users slash and then uh, your name of your user. So this can be anything. It has to be the name of your user. So you can uh, you can check that out here. So basically you have places here, desktop, you go documents, application. So it's the name of your home folder. So you go pr uh, your name probably. So yeah, you want to put that, and then slash um, your desktop, desktop, and then uh, you want to press enter here if it's on your desktop. But if it's like on a folder on your desktop, so I called it smack, you want to do uh, slash and then smack. Or it could be anything, it doesn't need to be in your desktop, it can also be in your document. So basically, the path of your folder here, you have to put that. So then hit enter, and uh, so now you're in the documents. And now what you want to do is um, change the permissions for Smack Leopard documents. So you want to do S uh, C H M O D, so schmod space, then plus X space, and then uh, you want to put Smack Leopard dot command. So then you hit enter, and then basically uh, you're all set up. So now you just need to run it. So once you so to run it, you want to put dot 
um, dot space, uh, I mean dot slash, and then without any spaces, smack leopard dot command. So then just hit enter, and then it should say AMS hardware present and initialized. So you can just minimize your terminal, and now normally uh, if you move your MacBook here, if you tilt it, uh, you can see that um, it changes the spaces. So yeah, it works great. Uh, you can, you'll can you see about the which ways it goes for the spaces. So basically if you go, if you push it up that way, which is basically that way for you, be sure you know that. So basically if you push it that way, it's going to go to the next space, so it's going to go like cross every time. And the other way, it's gonna go backwards. So yeah, uh, you can set that up as well in the uh, in the folder in the text uh, document. So yeah, I uh, hope it works. If you have any questions, it's quite confusing, I know, but uh, if you have any questions, uh, be sure to comment down below. Uh, also, if you have any suggestions or things like that, be sure to contact me. You can contact me through Twitter and uh, personal messaging or uh, my email, uh, which will all be in the description to the right. So yeah, thanks for watching. Again, uh, please leave comment, rate five stars, and subscribe. Peace.